Okay, so Saturday and um already posted a video but sort of wanted to get back into YouTube. So um yeah, I'm just gonna maybe uh try to be really consistent. So yeah, what I'm doing right now is just eating a little eating uh, some rice lentils, mung beans, you got some beet greens right there, which are sort of like uh, Swiss chard. Then you got some beets right there. Um, then you got some kale on the bottom right there, so pretty good. But uh, yeah. And um, it's 11.20 right now. Got up at 5 and did some math and finally actually got that proof done, so it's cool. But uh, I'm just gonna go um, go to the farmer's market, then I gotta work out too, so. Yeah, just gonna be like a day in the life, I guess. I mean, uh, go up to the farmer's market. 20 bucks for, um, it's gonna be pretty much about 20 bucks for all the vegetables for the week. It's my leftovers. Um, got one beet left, and then got a fennel bulb. Which I got like half of done, and then just barely any kale. Um, it's gonna use some reusable bags. Definitely gonna wanna reduce the plastic. I have to get this because I ended up buying a swapping the peppers out for that. So I ended up getting actually a lot more food for twenty bucks. Okay, so I give I made this. You see it's compost. Little compost bin. Slider. And um Actually made that for my mom for uh, Christmas, but um, I'm just gonna put these in it. I got these two weeks ago. They were looking pretty bad last week when I turned put them in here, and uh, they're actually nothing's really looking too bad about them. That's just lentils and it's so gross. Well, let's see this one. I like okay. This one was really spicy. Just jalapenos. But um, I'm not really gonna risk it. I mean, I'd probably, I'd actually, these are looking pretty fine, but I can say no to the peppers. I was gonna leave it in here until they're just like totally molded over. But um, you know, it looks like it hasn't aged since I put it in the top one. So I guess you've got, if you have peppers, I think putting them in Tupperware and seal them off might actually be a good idea. But, uh, yeah. Anyways, you see I got a, I'll show you. It's like a heat. Uh, it's actually looking pretty good. I don't know why I put that in there, but, uh, uh, not the great example, but I think I might be putting some sprouts in there. Just cause, uh, they smell like spoiled milk, so. Just got back. Twenty bucks. Got some, you know, two bunches of kale. Um, they don't have the colored greens, which I usually get, but got Swiss chard and a pound of Brussels sprouts. You can see. Whatever. You get the point. And we got some beets. Just one bunch, and then definitely eat those beet leaves. Pretty good. And got some broccoli. It's like, I don't know, pound. And then, uh, I don't know, I just got some peppers. Not really into them right now. Was into them, but, um, sort of expensive. And I don't know. Lately, they've been a little too spicy, so, like, it's just does not appeal to have it for a snack. But, yeah, all for 20 bucks, and, um, so, I almost finished the meal, but um, I'll leave for work in like seven minutes. So, I just packed like a good size thing.
Okay, so got off work. That change is flat. Yeah. Okay, finally got the. Finally got it. <laughs> Holy moly. Um, I think that took 25 minutes or at least 20 minutes, but whatever. I mean, flats, bro. Anyways, you know, head home. Okay, so finally home. Um, it's like nine o'clock. I mean, I left work at like eight. I did take a shower, but it was only like five minutes, you know? So, uh, yeah, like, yikes, dude. Whatever. Um, it doesn't even matter. It's Saturday. I don't, I'm not doing anything tomorrow. So. Anyways, gonna start eating. Got the, got the carrots right here. Uh, this meal is carrots, soy yogurt, and peanut butter. Some some homemade soy yogurt, and um, it's pretty, I mean, on its own, it's like almost tastes like stomach acid. It's like that, like gross. Um, but with peanut butter and stuff, man, and carrots, so great. Man, I got all these peanut butters right here that like. It's just at the bottom to get so thick, so I just end up opening up a new one, and then, I don't know, maybe I'll open up a new one today, because it's a little too thick, but anyways, hmm, yeah, see, so yeah, we got a pound of carrots right here, and we have 300 grams of soy yogurt, which doesn't really mean much, because, uh, I make it, and... You know, I strain the whey out, and it's not always the same consistency, so... I don't know, I just used to just have it for a probiotic, and... Just because I used to have, uh, regular Greek yogurt, and this meal is just, like... It's more of a snack, so I have a meal after it, but, like, it's just, like, the best thing, so... Yeah, so that's the amount of yogurt. Ugh. So nice. Yeah, we'll get the peanut butter in there and mix it all up. Um, now it's time to eat. Watch some YouTube. Um, so, pretty much the last meal. I might go with another like salad or something, but got some pretty overcooked pasta, potatoes, kale, broccoli. Got some Brussels sprouts in here too. So, yeah.